I was just showing you guys uh, my other truck that they let me drive at work. This is my uh, secondary company truck. It's kind of the beat down 68 Ford. I mean, you got the radio here. It don't work. You know, you, 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 nope, 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 nope. Nothing, nothing there. Nothing, no, I'm dead. Fan, look at that. You got the, uh, uh, look at that. that. That works real good there. That's fucked up. Yeah, that comes on. It's gold plated, as you see. That's all gold plated. It's got the sack, the sack uh, vents. You open them up. It lets that air come in on your sack, cools you down. Uh, what's it got for mileage here? Oh, look at that! It's only got like 3,400 miles. Fucking new truck. This is the uh, Duckhead version, as you see on there. This is a 1968 Ford Duckhead. It's got the uh, Boss power stripes on there. Another look at the uh, custom Ford Duckhead. This is a 1968 Ford Duckhead. Nice truck, dash. Right. Um, of course, you got the the good roof here, headliner not included. Um, yeah, I got the door handle, got the gas tank in the back, got a spare tire in the retard seat. That's for retards. Eh, not much to say about this one. It's got the cool uh, granny first, second, which is actually first. You got third, you got fourth, you got reverse way the fuck over here, which is sometimes a bitch to get in. No power steering, but you got one of these babies. And we gotta make a quick turn. Yeah, yeah, there she goes. I don't know. It's kind of weird the ignition being over on the left, too. Sometimes I, I fuck that up getting in and I get the key and ah, shit. Yeah, I got my own personal uh, name tag here. That's not bad. Not a bad truck. Here's my uh, code compliance. My, my legal DOT seat belts here. As you see, I don't know what the fuck happened to them, but they're fucked. Passenger, passenger doesn't fare any better. That's just how it was when I got in it. Here's another thing I forgot to mention. It's got its uh, its own uh, garbage chute. This is where we get rid of our garbage. Just uh, drop it on the floor and out she goes. No worries there. Fairly straight body. As you see, she's just got a little, little ouchy here. It's got the gold, gold hubcaps. This is a custom. Uh, those there, each one, I could probably sell that for uh, 80 bucks on eBay. Got a little ouchy here. Mm, got some blood. Um, another, another ouchie, but, you know, uh, cops haven't said anything yet about that, and the, the bailing wire's holding, so, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna roll with it. Got a little bit of oxidation in the paint. Uh, it did catch on fire once or twice, so you are gonna have that rust. Uh, let's see, what else we got here? We got, uh... We got a custom roof. <laughs> I don't know if y'all can see that one. That's that's all custom there. You, you can't find that anymore. They don't make it like that. Um, got a custom flatbed. Now, I've never seen a flatbed truck with fenders. I don't understand the reason why they put the fenders in the flatbed truck. I mean, the whole reason for a flatbed is to be flat. In fact, you have more than enough clearance on this truck. That the, in fact, I've had it loaded with quite a bit of weight, and I've never once had it up in that wheel well. I'd love to cut those off, but there's no point because this truck's not worth saving. It's got the uh, ABS. This is this is ABS plastic muffler. That's a three-inch exhaust, baby. That's how we that's how we do it. In fact, I believe it's starting to melt. 
Yeah, start. Yeah, there it is. Starting to warp in on itself. Got a little hot there. Here's the power plant. The monster. The beast. Uh, I don't know what it is. I I don't know what the fuck cubic inch this motor is. I know it's a V8. I know it's got a two barrel. Uh, I couldn't tell you if it was like a 302 or if it was a fucking 360. I don't think it's that though. I don't know what they put in them. I don't know what it is. Maybe somebody out there knows what it is who can tell me if they know Fords, but I never looked it up, never fucking paid attention to it. I don't care. So, but if you guys know what it is, go ahead and uh, go ahead and spill the beans if you want. The oil filter is placed right about here like so. There's a fuel pump like there, you know, and there's uh, that's how the water pumps hooked on. There's the distributor. If any of this helps you, I don't know. Coil in there. And, uh, spark plugs. Any of this helps. I don't know. Master cylinder. I don't know. Fuck up. Uh, brakes are actually good. They do lock up. The, the rear will lock up on you. With the drop of a hat if it's raining. And it's just kind of funny because I did it a couple times with people crossing the road. It scares the shit out of them. But hey, that's just what this truck does. It's all drum brakes. It's got the uh, custom heater. As you see, the heater system in this truck it just loops. So I get no heat in the winter time, which is why I don't drive this really in the winter. I, I stick with uh, old reliable over there. Got the battery held in by nothing. Absolutely nothing. Battery just slides around, goes wherever she fucking pleases. Whenever you take a corner, won't hit the brakes, whatever. Batteries are sliding. Crazy.